guys, it's Emily. Welcome back to my channel. Today I have a little project um, using a couple of the stamp sets that I received from In Love Arts. I will link everything below and I just wanted to remind you of um, the discount code for my subscribers and that will be in the description box as well. Um, all right, so I have um, two of the stamp sets and I've got a little puppy over here that really, really wants to just lay down on my lap and go to sleep. So hopefully she will, um, she will just decide to go lay down and chew on her chewy. So I have two of the stamp sets. I have the insect one and then the butterflies and flowers one. And um, I have this, uh, this gorgeous, um, I, I'm calling it muslin um, because I don't really know what it is, but my lovely friend Lori, hi Lori, um, from Lori's Creative Studio on Etsy um, gave this to me a long time ago and um, I immediately knew that I wanted to um, stamp on it and then I just haven't had time. So I'm going to do that today. And I also have this roll of um, washi tape. It's just script writing. It's nice and wide um, and I thought it might be nice to add um, some stamping onto that. So what I've done is I have um, laid out, just, you know, I've laid out like four pieces here on a piece of wax paper so that I can stamp on it and then it'll still, you know, I can easily um, just pull this off when I want to use it. So that's what I have done so far. Um, and I have a few different um, inks here. I have my stays on in Timber Brown, and then I also have a few um, archival inks in various uh, colors here. Um, and I also have my scrubber, my stamp scrubber pad, which I have yet to use. So I will be using that today. So, um, pretty cool. I hope it works pretty well. I just um, sprayed some stamp cleaner on this side and then this side is dry. Hopefully I, I did the sides right. <laughs> I feel like I probably messed that up, but um, I, I think I did it right because this one actually comes out so you can clean it. Um, and this one is, I believe this one's stuck in here. So <laughs> I think I did it right, but I'm going to try to start taking better care of my stamps. And um, that's why I, that's why I purchased that because usually um, I don't take very good care of my stamps. All right, so let's get started. Um, let's go ahead and start with the washi. We will, I'm just gonna kind of, I'm gonna do everything. I'm just gonna use all of these probably um, in some way or another. Um, I don't have enough space on my desk to have them all in view, but that's okay. I have my acrylic blocks um, let's just go ahead and get started. So I think I'll start with, um, I think I'll just start with some brown. Or you know what, maybe on the washi I'll use color. Uh, I don't know, we'll see. We'll, we'll just, we'll play around and see what we get. Um, and I'm, tr I'm gonna try not to be too like perfect or matchy-matchy about it. I just kind of want this to be um, a fairly quick project. So I have the B, which is probably easier if I show you on here, the little B. So I don't know, I don't think it matters which way he goes. I'm just gonna ink him up here. Make sure, make sure I don't have ink where I don't want ink. And let's just go ahead and stamp him on here. So I hope everybody is having a good day. Oh, that's super cute. I like how that looks. Let's do a couple more of him. Oops. Oh. And my thought was then I would just have, you know, maybe I'll do a slightly different. I would just have some, you know, some washi that is ready to go and I can use it um, you know, for projects as I need it. I think I, do oh yeah, I did. <laughs> that, was, that was not good. Just a second. Let me grab a wipe. <laughs> that 
that was just a mess. Oh my, okay. Let's try that again. I don't even want to put that on the, uh, the stamp cleaner because that was just a nightmare. I will use it and dry it off here a little bit. Oh, well, now there's, yeah, whatever. Okay, oh, let's try again. <laughs> lightly ink the stamp, Emily, lightly ink it. All right, there we go. All right, let's go ahead and clean this off. There we go. Uh, uh, it works pretty well. I mean, it's not clear, clear, but you know, I'm not expecting perfection. <laughs> it's just, a, it's a good thing that I'm cleaning them. That's, that's, I feel like that is a an accomplishment in in itself. So, all right, what next? Let's do um, let's do this butterfly here, but we'll do the butterfly in a different color. Let's do a purple butterfly. So I'm gonna ink it this way because this is a smaller ink pad. And I know that I'm, if you notice that the script goes this way, that's why I'm doing everything sideways. <laughs> if you were, if you were concerned. Cute. All right, let's do, I like that purple. Let's do another one in purple. So yeah, how's everybody been? Everybody doing okay? I know there are just some crazy, crazy things going on in our country and in the world right now. And I just, I hope all of you are safe and healthy and doing well. We're doing okay here. Um, nothing to Nothing too crazy going on, um, you know. All right, oh, that cleaned really well. Okay, all right, let's do a pink butterfly and then we'll move on to a different, um, a different stamp. This one's gonna be pretty light, I think. This is, um, pink peony and if I remember correctly it's a pretty light color but that's okay I don't care oh yeah <laughs> you can barely see that <laughs> it's just really really light all right maybe not maybe not that color it's just a little light but it's okay all right I'll get that cleaned off and let's do we have some like like bugs. Um, no, let's do a dragonfly. That'll be, that's a happier bug. <laughs> All right, let's put him on there and I think we'll just do brown. For him. So an update on Nick, he is still in Columbus. Um, he, he got a job as, um, I think they're calling it chief editor for a podcast company who is looking to expand. Oh, that's pretty. And they, um, they want some written content on their website. That's messy. Um, so he will be in charge of um, of that part of the company. Um, it's super cool, something that he is incredibly excited about. Um, you know, 
something that when he was in school was really uh, something interesting, you know, it interest, interested him quite a bit. Um, so he is looking forward to that. I think his first piece is due um, next week. Doesn't seem to want to clean the um, stays on ink very well. Hmm, I might have to try something else to clean those. But like I said, at least I'm sort of taking care of them. Um, let's do, all right, let's just go ahead and do a creepy crawly bug. Uh, Tyler, Tyler would be disappointed in me <laughs> for having uh, roach stamps. I don't know that anybody likes roaches, but um, he is, he definitely does not like them. When they got home, when he got back to his apartment, um, a friend drove with him and he had his cat with him that he brought up here. And she immediately went and found a dead cockroach in their apartment and brought it to him. <laughs> I was like, well, she's home now and <laughs> she feels safe, I guess. Um, all right, let's see what that looks like. I'm gonna show you close up because it's a little far away. So here we go. We've got a couple little bees and a couple purple butterflies and that really, really faint pink butterfly, but I think that looks cool. Um, and then a couple dragonflies and our little, our little roach buddy. I don't know what kind of bug, I don't know anything about bugs, so it's probably not a roach at all, but to me it is. <laughs> it's just a bug. Let's have about that. So anyway, yeah, um, Tyler is back in Florida and, you know, still doing school online. They haven't opened up yet. Um, and he's not, he's pretty sure they're not going to open up before um, August. So it's kind of, you know, it's unfortunate because it's difficult to do, you know, film um, classes and stuff when you can't even um, get into the studio and stuff, you know, it's, it's just kind of frustrating. Um, let's do this guy. I like him. Anyway, yeah, so that's kind of an update. I think Nick is going to come back down here. The nice thing, oh, I didn't even, yeah, anyway, he got that editor-in-chief job or chief editor. Um, it's based in Columbus. However, he can pretty much, you know, live anywhere he wants and still, you know, do the job, which is wonderful. Um, and then he it, he applied for another job um, at another podcast. I think they're a podcast company based in Florida. Um, but again, he can, or no, they're based they're based out of New York. Um, he can be anywhere and still do the job. So um, someone that he graduated with got a job with this company and they were uh, still hiring. So um, I haven't heard, I haven't heard anything about that for a couple days. So I need to call him and see if he's heard anything back from them. Um, but he's probably gonna come back here, at least short term, um, uh, for a little bit. And then he might just go ahead and head back to, um, oh, it's here, <laughs> uh, Florida because you know he's still paying rent down there um on that apartment so he could you know might as well be down there all right let's see let's do let's do a couple flowers here and i'm gonna do them like multicolored. hopefully i'm gonna try so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna take um the peeled paint and I am gonna try and just get that on um, the leaf and the stem part of this flower. Can you see what I'm doing? I can see what I'm doing. I think there's a little bud there, but it's gonna be green because I don't think I can, I don't think I'm that talented. All right, so. Then, since that pink is so light, I'm gonna use the Dusty Concord, and I'm just gonna add that to the flower part. Let's see what happens. 
I think it'll be pretty. Oh, yeah, that is very pretty. Let me hold that up so you can see. I like that a lot. Okay, let's do that again. That was, that turned out pretty cool. So, add green to this part. Here. So yeah, that that is that. Let's see. Um, we had the puppers to the vet um, a couple days ago, and everybody is healthy and good. Um, we have an appointment for um, Pixie to get spayed um, on the thirtieth, which is good. Um, I don't want her to go into heat um, before that. Uh, otherwise, it just is a whole nother level of complications and such. So, all right, I did pretty well. Let's do, I'm going to do one more and then we'll move on to the fabric. Um, let's see. So indecisive. Let's do one of these butterflies. And I think, I think I'm just going to do the brown. I like how that looks. Um, I like how, yeah, I like that. So I think we'll just do that. Um, yeah, what else is going on? Not much. Not well, I mean, a lot's going on, but <laughs> nothing terribly exciting, I guess. Uh, yeah. There we go. Let's do, let's just do a couple more while we have this out. Cool. I'll just finish off this strip. All right. There we go. Let me clean this off. Let's go ahead and move on to, let me sh I'll show you real quick, a little close up. I think that'll be really pretty and it'll be really fun to have, um, to have that on hand for future projects. Let's get that out of the way. All right, now uh, we can, we can do some on this fabric. Um, I wonder if I should have, no, I think it'll be fine. Okay. So I'm going to just use brown on the fabric, I think, because I like, um, I like how that looks. Let's go ahead and just do uh, this little itty bitty tiny butterfly. Move this a little closer now. There we go. I've never inked on fabric before. Um, or have I? I? Yeah, maybe I have. Oh, look how cute. Oh, that is stinking adorable. Okay, yeah, I like that a lot. <laughs> I like that a lot. Oh, I wanted to mention um, that there is a uh, crafty retreat in the works. That one's a little darker, but I like it. Um, it's still in the very early stages. However, if you want information, it's probably going to be held in the Ohio, Kentucky, Indiana area. Um, 
there hasn't been, we haven't, you know, like solidified a location, but um, the person who, um, who started this is Dorothy at Done by Dorothy. Uh, so I'm going to link to her Facebook group because she is, um, you know, gathering information there, um, people that might be interested, that kind of thing. Um, and then if you might be interested in a crafty retreat, it would be in 2021 at some point, um, uh, you know, kind of a like long weekend, Friday through Sunday kind of thing. Um, then you can go and um, join her group and um, that will be a good place to get information. So I will link that below. Um, I'm super excited. I'm so happy that Dorothy has let me help um, coordinate. Um, I'm, it's so new to me. I've never done this before. Um, so also if you have gone to retreats before and you have some, you know, ideas of what you, what you enjoy, um, at a retreat, let me know because we're, you know, we're just trying to get ideas and, and, you know, have some, have some things that people are, you know, really interested in classes and, um, you know, maybe booth rentals where you could, um, sell things and, um, and that kind of thing. So I think it's going to be a fabulously, awesomely good time. And, um, I think it'll be really cool to be able to meet, um, uh, some, you know, meet some people face to face. And that would be, you know, that sounds really fun to me. Um, so yeah, head over there for more information as it comes out. Like I said, right now, it's just the early stages. Um, you know, nothing has been like set in stone yet. We don't, you know, we're just, just sort of early stages, but, um, yeah, I'm super excited about that. I think it'll be a lot of fun. Um, Okay, I'm gonna stop babbling about that. So here's a dragonfly. I am loving this so, so much. This is so cute. And these stamps are amazing. <laughs> um, yeah, they're very good quality. I'm very good. Um, I think they're some of the best cling stamps that I have ever had. Uh, as far as, you know, nice and clear and good images. All right, what else do we have? Um, I haven't done any flowers yet. So let's, let's look at the flowers. Let's do this longer um, flower. Let's see what that looks like. Uh, what else is in the works? Um, yeah, I don't know. I feel I have a lot of things. I have a lot of things <laughs> happening all at once. Um, so it's a little bit, um, overwhelming, but I think it's also, it's also good. I like, I like being busy. I work well, um, to a certain degree. I work well under pressure. Um, oh, that's so cute. And we're getting to, we're sort of getting to the point where Oscar can kind of be in the craft room. Um, it's not perfect because I still just need to kind of puppy proof it a little bit. Um, he still, you know, he still wants to chew on everything. Oh my gosh. And nothing deters him. I probably have said this before, but I'm going to do another one of those because that is super cute. Um, and Lori, if you're watching this, please tell me what kind of fabric this is. I want to get more, um, or anybody, whoops, anybody else watching, uh, that, you know, knows what kind of fabric this is because I love it. It's like, it must, I think it's muslin. Um, I feel like that must be what it is, but having never had muslin before, I am not a hundred percent sure. Uh, that it is so yeah just let me know because I want to I want to get it and <laughs> let me know if you if you dyed it um, what you used 
Oh, super, super cool. All right, let's clean this one off. Where are we? We're at like 25 minutes. So we've got, we're almost to the end of our, our fabric here. So I'm just gonna finish this off. Hopefully you guys are okay with that. And let's see, let's look at, let's look at our stamps again and see what we have here. Uh, let's do, this is a pretty butterfly. Let's do him. Oh, and possibly at the retreat, depending on where Nick ends up, if he's still living, you know, in Ohio, um, Dorothy said that it would be okay for him to uh, come for a little bit and help me teach a class, a beginner's class. Um, so I'm so excited about that. I haven't even asked him yet. <laughs> I don't think I will. It's just going to be a, hey, Nick show up here and help me teach a class. I know he's gonna, I know he's gonna be tickled to death that, you know, he's allowed to do that. Um, <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I know he's gonna be, he will, he won't say no unless he, you know, has something else going on, but, um, oh, that's so pretty. Um, yeah, so if you love Nick's tutorials, um, you might wanna come to the retreat and take that class because, it's bound to be um, a humorous, fun time. <laughs> oh, I do love my kids so much. They, they just, they make me laugh and they bring me so much joy. Um, yeah, I miss Tyler. It was nice having him here, but I understand he needed to get back to regular, you know, sort of regular life, whatever that looks like these days. Let's move this string out of the way. All right, there we go. Cool, all right, let's look at that up close. Oops. Oh, I think it turned out awesome. Oh, I love that so, so much. How cute is this gonna be? to, you know, sort of cut apart and add, oops, let me close my ink before I forget. There we go. So, so cute. Oh, I did it this way for a while. <laughs> I sort of changed direction, not that it matters. All right, that is super cute. Let me clean this. All right, guys, well, let's see. Um, yeah, if you have any ideas for the retreat, let me know. Um, if you, yeah, let me know what you think about um, the stamping. I think that looks really cool. I'm gonna do more of that um, in the future, absolutely, um, because I think it turned out really nice. And then also on the washi, I think, I'm sure I'm not the first one to do this. I know I'm not, but um, yeah, I think that adds something really cool to um, the, the script um, background. All right, so um, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Um, it really does um, help my channel and it's such an easy way to do, you know, to, um, to help me out. I love, I love all of you guys. Um, I am approaching 2,500 subscribers, which I cannot believe. Um, I may do a giveaway, uh, just a small little thank you giveaway when I get to that point. Um, because yeah, I like to thank you guys and I love giving stuff away. It's just super fun and I haven't given anything away for a little while. So I am due for that. Um, check out Dorothy's Facebook page. Um, that'll be linked below and, um, check out the, the stamp sets from In Love Arts and go and make sure you use that coupon code um, if you do head over there. All right, guys, um, stay safe, stay healthy, and I will see you in the next video. Take care. Bye.